Alrighty then. So, yeah, that's like the most fearful thing for a last Eslati run. A game crash and then losing the game. But thankfully, I'm still able to load this previous game. Uh, in a video that I didn't post, I tried talking to Finian again and the uh, options which I had the new options which I had selected had still not been registered as being selected so somehow this is the exact same save the exact same save state as the previous game so I'm going to proceed uh, without talking to Finian I've put a bug report on the owlcat forms hopefully I'll get a response there and I saw somewhere that you're supposed to do bug reports with Alt B. So let's see what happens if I do Alt B. Ooh, bug report. Wonder if you guys can see this. This is pretty sweet. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do I need to put my real email address here? Here, I'll put my. I'll put this email address. I'm okay with people seeing that email address. Discord, no. Um, I don't think I accepted the Discord role. I'm not even sure what that means. All right. Uh, when? This is kind of critical. Uh, sure. Um, I think I've already agreed to this at some point in time, but let's go ahead and agree it. Oh, then I'll actually start getting email this address if I do that um now let's uncheck this okay let's do this what does aspect mean oh uh I think this is none. All right, let's go. Okay, um, so let's, all right, it's responsive to the mouse right now. Godspeed. All right, so let's see if it was an inventory thing rather than a Phineas thing because I need to do some inventory management. Such as, I've decided that I will just make um, this Claw of Jiska. Um, where is she? Sela's primary weapon. I really have no idea why I didn't do this already. It's magical, it's flaming, and it's, oh, it's not cold iron. That's why I didn't do that. Um, yeah, so that would be why I did not make the claw of Jiska her primary weapon. Because it is not cold iron. All right, scratch that. Instead, I will make this. Cold Iron Short Spear plus one, her primary weapon. Uh, so, this is a worse crit range, and, and 
uh, lower base damage. But at least it's magical, at least it's cold. Nope. Egg. I'm still debating this. Um. No, I'm gonna go Claw of Jiska anyway. Hmm. Alright. There you are. So I will give you the Cold Iron Short Spear. I will give you the Claw of Jiska. And. Let's see if the game is responsive. No! Oh, there it is. Okay. There we go. Good. Okay, let's do some more inventory management stuff. Uh, first of all, this helmet just looks absolutely ridiculous on her. Um, what am I using for that slot? I'm using this. Which is maximum hit points. Or increased hit points. That's right. Mm. The more hit points is a good thing. Um, maybe I can give that helmet to Sila. No, she's... Oh yeah, she has charisma. That helps her. Of course, I could give this charisma band to our oracle. Mm, that might be a good idea. I'm going to give that to Darren. I'll give Sela this. I don't know. This thing looks so super on anybody. It really does. Am I really going to give up fire resistance 10 just because of how it looks? Oh, man. All right, where's Darren? Hmm. All right. Um, I guess I'll live with it like that for now. All right. We also have a new pet, which I think is exactly the same as another one. As this one. Yeah, it's exactly the same as this one. Alright. So, who do I have that actually does nature? Uh, not trained. Not trained. She's trained. Not trained. Not trained. Not trained. Really? He's not trained and he's plus six? Oh, Hunter and Hardy Meal. Ember. Ember's trained. Perception, not that great. I'd rather give this to somebody who has a pretty high perception, like Lan, just to make it even better, but I can give this to Ember. Uh, Seela's trained. And her perception is terrible. Hmm. Ember or Sela? Let's give this to Ember. Alright. Ember can take the tiger. Okay, so that's that. Alright, yes, I'm going to keep the plus five hit points. Damage rolls against swarms? Um, sure. Uh, yes, I'm keeping the cloak. I'm keeping this. What about this rope? Plus one bonus to all saves against fear. Yeah, I'll keep the robe. 
plus one morale bonus on attack rolls. Plus two bonus on damage rolls while mounted. All right. So if I'm going to be using heroism on myself, which I probably am, then these gloves should go to somebody else. Problem is I only have heroes once per day, and I might be traveling to multiple places and not have that uh, heroism at multiple places. Yeah. yeah, I'll keep that there. And yeah, I'll keep that. These goggles are looking pretty bad. I'll give these goggles to Lan. There. That's better. Much better. Alright, what about other miscellaneous gear that people have? So, I'm happy with that. I should probably give this to somebody else. Um, I'm going to give this to somebody else. I'm going to give that to Sila. Sorry! Oh, wait, she already has this. Oh yeah, plus two. Well, yeah, well, we can switch amulets. <laughs> there we go. Where'd Darren go? There he is. All right, moving on along. Oh, it's Finian, yeah. Oh, I finally found that purple stone. This was from the, this was from the Aeon Path. And I can't unequip it. That's pretty weird. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, I'm never going to use that. Might as well keep it there. Um, I think I've sold some Masterwork Cold Iron Rapiers at some point in time, but that's not too worrying. Wait. Yeah, I got rid of her crossbow because it was too heavy. Hero cloak? Yeah, I'll keep the hero cloak with him. That'll work. Ember, I need to give her a crossbow or something again. Just in case I ever decide to use this thing with her. You might actually need a ranged weapon. Maybe even a crossbow. I'm not sure. Uh, next time I find a crossbow, I'll give it to her. Hopefully. Alright, what's this? Oh yeah, magic missile. I really dislike this helmet so badly. It's awful. Alright, I think that's good enough for inventory management. I'm going to drop off these what's her she is this plus one cold iron plus one cold iron that does a little bit more all right let's do that and then i'll sell this oh wait there's also the scimitar right yeah plus one cold iron there we go that's her primary weapon This can go back to here now. 
plus one cold iron does a little something else. So its damage is only its base damage is D six instead of a D eight from a long sword. Uh, but it has a better crit model. Crit range, 18 or 20, instead of 19 or 20. Alright, so I can sell this. I can sell this. Oh yeah, what's this? Ooh, where am I? Hmm? Who is most likely to use... I think Lan is most likely to use this. Um, unless I want to give Sela the persuasion bonus. But Lan's the one doing all these mobility and athletics checks. And that only has a few arrows left, I think. But I have two more sets of 50. Oh, uh, let's see. I skipped over one of these. Is it this one? Yeah, that is an arcane spell. And I think we're ready to roll with everything else. Alright, so let me just go sell some stuff to Camel. Show me what you have. Sell that. Sell that. Deal. Let's go Notice back in on. here. Let's set up spell books. All right. Um, eventually, when I set out to do this quest, scouting out the Tower of Estrad, I might end up taking Nenio. And the reason I might end up taking Nenio... Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Oh. She has a... That's right, I leveled her up. The reason I might take Nanio is for invisibility. So, I'm going to prep as many invisibilities as I can. She has a new spell here. Grease is kind of effective. Sometimes. Let's actually take a second mage armor, though. Alright, that'll work. Who else prepares spells? I think Wolgif prepares spells. He can't cast third level spells. Second level spells, that's fine. First level spells, that's fine. Okay, let's rest. I think I'm ready to rest. Unavailable, unavailable, unavailable. Alchemy's available. That's cool. Alright. So we can still do this at the Defender's Heart. That's cool. Um, so. She does not have scribe scrolls. Uh, Nenio probably does. There we go. So I can do that. Um, it still doesn't tell me. 
Does it tell me which components it requires? Oh, I could get some scrolls and visibility if I would go buy the level 2 kit. But. Oh, here it is. Alright. So, this requires rainbow quartz and bazaar. Okay. Uh, what happens if I downgrade it? Still takes those two things. 100% DC is still 11. Well, what's the DC if I go up to... Okay, DC's 13. So, doing it at a higher caster level affects the DC. Um, but... If I, if I do it at a different caster level, it'll take up a different space on the inventory. So that's a little clutter annoyance. But, let's go ahead and do it at caster level 3. All right, I'm starting to figure out this mechanic a little bit. Oh, uh, what about brewing potions though? Let's go back. Let's see. Oh, I can do both. All right. Um, no brew potions, no brew potions, no brew potions. I think he's the only one that has brew potions, but he doesn't have a spell book. So, she's scribing scrolls. Yeah, so nothing doing there. So, we're going to do hearty meal. Uh, eight, two, eight, eight, twelve, eight. So she's going to do hearty meal. Wait, let me check, because I don't think. Yeah, it's not letting me choose a potion with him, because he doesn't have a spell book. All right, let's go back to here. I think we're good. You say you love to have fun, but your eyes don't look happy at all. Why are you lying? Oh, seer, you have glimpsed my secret sorrow. I admit it. I have the ability to feel more than one emotion at any given moment. Okay, so we have rested. Let's head out. I'm not gonna, oh. Oh, wow, okay, this was unexpected. Oh, uh, okay. So, um, I will be able to save this game and then Uh, this one, yeah. So I can save this game and handle this demon attack at a different time. But, yeah, looks like we're doing this next. Alright. This is Focus Bite. 
having survived the bug of crashing when talking with Phineas. Signing out. Sayonara. <laughs>